Hey friends, it's Sarah from Gilkey's Limited Adventures and I'm doing something different today. I'm out and about and I'm going shopping for some new Operation Christmas Child items. I'm at the Dollar Tree right now and let's see what kind of new and fun items they have here today. Yeah, survive the dollar store. I got some fun things. So I'm, today I'm just looking for some unique things or things that I don't already have. So um, I just got a few little things that I'll show you what I got. I got these two little discovery books, um, penguins and tigers in case someone wants to do like a penguin or tiger theme box. My husband's favorite animal is tiger. So when I saw that, I was like, oh yeah. And I realized that um, these kids might not be able to read English, but if you look at them, there are just lots of great pictures in there. So I thought these would be kind of fun. And then the only other thing I got were um, these. They're the, um, the fans. I love giving these to the, um, the older girl boxes. I think they're beautiful. I mean, honestly, like if they go to a climate that's hot, they're useful. They're also just beautiful if someone wants to, you know, decorate with them. I I don't know. I've just loved these. And I actually think I got almost all the same style. Um, these black ones with pink because I guess I thought those were the prettiest. Cause yes, I think I got seven of those fans. So um, not too much at the dollar store, but now we're going to head over to Walmart and we're going to see if they have any. I'm hoping to score some Easter dresses on clearance. We will see what they have, but come along with me. Now we're on to our next door. My husband's in an appointment right now, so I'm just waiting for him to get done and um, killing some time doing a little bit of shopping. That Walmart was an absolute bust. I got nothing every spot that was on clearance was empty except for maybe two barbie dolls which i already got barbie dolls this year so um yeah nothing and this is the this is a good thing about living in a small town there's less people shopping at your walmart and the stuff is like the clearance stays a little bit longer here the people just scoop it right up um i've been in this bigger city for just like two hours and I'm so glad I live in a small town. I don't know how you guys feel, but I haven't seen a cow or a cornfield <laughs> for two hours and I think it's breaking my heart. I'm not, I'm not used to this. My husband probably thinks I'm a baby. I gotta go pick him up from his appointment and I'll take you with me. Next stop, I got my husband back with me and we are going into Hobby Lobby. So let's see, hopefully they have some clearance or some good deals here. We're at Hobby Lobby and we found our first score. 75% off. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, it's so cute. We picked up a peacock while we were at Hobby Lobby. <laughs> He's joining us today. I'm so excited, you guys. There were so many great deals at Hobby Lobby for Operation Christmas Child the spring or summer things were out and they were all 40% off and then the Easter stuff was 75% off on clearance. So I will just show you. I don't know exactly all the prices, but they were good prices. Um, we'll start with these $4.99, so 40% off the, that. These emoji little bouncy balls, that's a great deal on these. I got a couple of those. Um, let's get to the Easter things. Look at these cutest little like Easter cinch bags with a bunny on them. They're really fluffy and fuzzy. They were 75% off $4.99. I got a few of those. <laughs> it's, it's kind of my thing when I see clearance. I want to buy it all up, but I never do. I always leave a few things just because I think if someone wants to come buy them for themselves or their kids, I don't want to snatch it all. So I just got three of those. These little cutest little bunnies i got a ton of these 75 percent off 2.99 and they you wind them up and they hop so these were a great find i absolutely love them they're adorable about two and a quarter and then these were a summertime find but they're little friendship bracelets um these were 3.99 40 percent off so they say best friends on them i thought that was kind of cute Okay, here's some more summer items. These were $5.49, 40% off. They're just little squeezy toys. But I thought this would be super fun if I did like an under the sea kind of mini themed box or two. I actually got two of those. 
um, for like a two to four year old. They're just really cute little plastic toys. So love those. And then I have a, a net game that needs a bigger ball. But then um, William wants to do a soccer ball box. So we got a couple of these. They were $3.99 for two, 40% off that, of course. And then we got this soccer ball, paddle ball, because William wants to do a soccer box. I mean, we do soccer balls in lots of our boxes, but he wants to do like a mini themed soccer mm -hmm. box for a boy. And you paid full price for nothing, right? I didn't pay full price for anything, that's right. I got these, um, they are like airplanes and they have, um, s make six different ones. So I'm gonna split these on either three or six boxes. I'm not sure. I might have to photocopy this or something. If I split it in three boxes and I'll just cut these so they can kind of understand what needs to be done on how to put them together. Um, if it's not super, you know. And they're little planes? They're planes, yep, they're cute planes. And the reason I got these is because uh, at the dollar store, you saw earlier I got a tiger book. <coughs> so I thought this could go in a box with like a little mini tiger theme. So I thought that was cute. And then the other one looks like a shark and an eagle, so. And one of us, one of their favorite animals is a tiger. I already told them. <laughs> I'm really having tons of fun with those mini theme boxes. So, um, yeah, so now I'm on the hunt for some of that kind of stuff. Okay, the last bag. Oh, lots if, of stuff. If you like the mini theme boxes, throw out some theme ideas. We might try to do yeah. them. Yeah. Okay, so speaking of that, we're going to do a couple bunnies, but we got these bunny ears different I got three different colors I didn't go overboard on these because I don't want my boxes to be too like full of bunny Easter stuff $2.99 that was 75% off of $2.99 so um, those are only $1.79 and then these these cutest little bunnies they came in blue and pink and just listen so cute I got one, two, three, four, five, six of those. A little under two dollars. Two something, yeah. Yeah, right around two dollars and something. And and that's I think that's a great um, for a wow item, a especially over $2. one that sings. And if you pair it with these um, these ears, and then that bunny that hops, like I think that's a super cute little mini theme. So yes, I got um, six of those. The bunny ears. We got these. They're just like a beaded. Cross, like a necklace a or a hanging item. Or yeah, something. just a nice. I think an older girl, girl might like that a lot. I got a couple of those. Go to your Hobby Lobbies though, because these were some great deals. I feel like I got a lot of stuff for a little bit of. I think uh, all those things, and I'll spread it out on the table later and let you see the whole thing. Fifty six dollars only. So yeah. it was a really good deal. Thanks for coming along shopping with me today. I think that's my last store. I'm about shopped out. I need to get back to my little my little small town but thanks for coming along with us today we appreciate you all right we're back home with all this stuff and i'm going to take it out of the packages and put it in this tote in order to bring downstairs into our shoebox room so um i just wanted to talk a little while we did this i am not the biggest shopper and um we live in a small town, so going out shopping today to the bigger city was um, a bit much. <laughs> I don't know. It She's was... looking over at me. I'm going to come join you then. I didn't want to be in the way. It, it, was, it was fun, but it was fighting traffic and all of their clearance is already gone because people pick through it right away. And... Um, I don't know if you can see these, honey, but these are the dollar store fans I got. Oh, Aren't they pretty? Beautiful. I've gotten them before, but not quite like this. Part um, of why she went out today, I'm blind. I haven't been able to drive for a long time now. And I go a little stir crazy in the house. So every now and then she likes to let me get out and see the world. So we <laughs> incorporated part of that today along with a shoebox shopping haul. So it was a good day. I had a great day with my wife. Yeah, it was, it was a fun day. Um, it was a fun day. I love getting these things. You know what? I always say I don't sh like shopping, but honestly, when I'm shopping for shoebox stuff, it's probably the shopping I do like because I just, it's fun to find all these fun, cute 
colorful things. Um, and it's nothing that I have to find a place for in my house. I'm like very anti-stuff and anti-clutter. So, um, yeah, but this is one thing I know they're going to go in the basement, go in some boxes and go right back out the door. I get a lot of, a lot of, watch, a lot of pleasure watching her do this because you could just see when she's in the store like her eyes light up and the brain is calculating like oh I bet I could do a mini team box with this so, whatever William's the he's my budget guy I'm always like what's 75% off of this and what do you think this would be and like is this worth it because you know I don't like to spend like you know everything's gone up so when we're talking about stuffies and stuff um, at Walmart, I got those for two seventy five or two two seventy nine, and is that what they were? Two ninety seven. Two ninety seven. And I thought that was a great deal because they were great quality and and nice. But I mean, you start spending that much on each toy in a shoebox, and your shoeboxes can get really expensive. And I like to do a lot of them, so um, it, it can it can be a bit much if you don't look for these deals. And um, more so. balls. Show them a close-up of those bunnies. I think those are just adorable. Oh, yeah. And watch what they do. Let me get this trash out here. Maybe. <laughs> that's that's really cute. I don't know who wouldn't love that. They're just so soft and like little chicks almost, I think. Yeah. Can you scooch some of those things over here? Sure. Some silver toys. I wanted to talk really quick about something that I'm considering a blessing in disguise. And if you think about it, it really does go along with the shopping I did today. So, um, I'm not sure, honey, was there something on the seat when you sat down? Yes. Yeah, I'm could you grab it. that for me? Yeah. I was going to talk about this. <laughs> so, we always order our letters and our picture from Walgreens and I talked about that in a previous video if you um, haven't seen it it is on our channel and I read the letter so just like always I ordered 60 letters um, for this year and I got this envelope in the mail and these are supposed to be like greeting cards you know like Christmas cards I got this letter it, you know the big package in the mail and I was like why are they coming like that because these are supposed to be cards with envelopes they didn't cut them <laughs> I, they're sheets. So, I mean, and no envelopes. So I contacted Walgreens and I was like, I'm, I mean, you sent the, I mean, I guess I could use these because you sent the cards and I wasn't going to use the envelopes anyway, but this is, this is not what you pay for, you know? So when I contacted the, and the quality is not that great. If, and I'm not sure if you can see it. It's not as good as our past cards. It's kind of grainy and washed out I mean it's okay it's good enough I mean I would send these um but they're not cut so um can you hear me that so my mom's like well so anyway I, I contacted Walgreens and they said um we can reship them out to you or we can send you a, we could just give you a refund and I said I'll take the refund because I it's gonna take me some work but I can cut these we have this tiny little paper cutter my mom let me borrow one at a time it does and i've gotten about through about half of these or maybe not even a little bit at a time a little bit at a time but i've been cutting them and um and now they're free so the reason i say it's a blessing in disguise because um they're free the disguise part is that it's been taking me a long time to cut them but what this cost paid for all of this today yeah. So what I got refunded on that paid for all of this stuff I got today when we went out shipping. So, shopping. So, um, yeah, that was a really, a, if you think about it that way, um, you know, I don't mind doing, I mostly don't mind doing all that extra work cutting those um, to get all this stuff for free. So that's, that's how I'm looking at it. Um, I would say, I mean, that's a let down a little bit when it first happened, but kudos to Walgreens. They, they quickly made oh, yeah. that right. Their service was, was good. Uh, I would order again tomorrow. Yeah, so and, nothing like that. Right. And we've been ordering from Walgreens, you know, from the get go, Pretty like much. always all our Christmas cards and everything. So thanks for coming along with us. 
Thanks for hanging out while I cut off all these tags. This can be a tedious job, but it's always nice when your husband sits at the table and talks to you during it and when I get to explain a little bit um, about what we bought and these blessings in disguise. These little rabbits, I, I just find them adorable. They sing, Jesus loves me. They're just really cute. The only, very only one thing I'm a little bit nervous about is that if you don't have to press hard. So I'm afraid like if, if they really get stuck in a box, they're cute anyway and they say Jesus loves me. So when that little singer goes out or if it sings all the way in a cargo ship over to a different country, they're still going to be cute even without it. That happened once to us. We loaded up all our boxes in the back of our car to take to the church to send them, you know, on their way. And we could hear a car in the back. Remember, room, 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 just over and over and over and over. And I think it might've been beeping too. I don't think that that one works anymore. <laughs> well, thanks for coming along with us today on this just shopping trip and now cutting these open, hearing about our blessing in disguise that made this all basically possible. And um, thanks to my husband for coming along and joining us today. It's been fun. <laughs>